Hey guys and welcome to another video of Gus Random Reviews. In this video, I will be reviewing the Oral V Pro 1000 Cross Action Electric Toothbrush. This is the pink version. Before we proceed with the actual demonstration of this product, it is important to note what this product contains. This product contains just the charger, just the handle, and one brush head. So it comes with the instructional manual. It comes with the handle, which is a rechargeable battery operated. It comes with the charger, and it comes with just one brushing head. So here's what to expect if you happen to buy this electric, electric toothbrush. The main charging section here takes about 22 hours for a fully charge. Once it's fully charged, this unit can go about 10 days um, with one single charge until you have to recharge it again. Now the uh, brush here can easily attach and detach from the main unit as well as can easily be cleaned. Now you don't really rinse this main unit in water, you pretty much just grab like a wet cloth and just wipe it down as well as the main charging area there. The toothbrush will operate about two minutes uh, until it completely turns off. It gives you like, uh, like, a, like a signal every 30 seconds, letting you know that it's time for you to switch sides um, in your mouth so that it completely you know, goes uh, around the two minute cycle. It also, uh, it's, it's smart, meaning that it senses when you brush too hard with, with the pressure sensor. It gives you an indicator. It's mentioned it is a rechargeable battery with only one mode. So all you have to do is just turn it on and then press the on and off button once again to turn it off. So while this unit only came with one brush, I actually purchased additional brushes, not necessarily uh, oral B related, but these are um, alternatives, ultra sensitive, and they are actually compatible with the Oral B Pro 1000. This here, as you can see, there's a little difference. You have this little seal there. This one doesn't have it, but it actually is compatible with this toothbrush. As you can see, you fully um, place it in the main unit. And as mentioned, all you do is you turn it on. Now this is not a full 360 spin. It actually goes left and right, vibrating several times. Uh, Noise-wise, it's tolerable. It's not that very loud. And it's actually not that heavy either. And it actually vibrates gently in your hand and it's not necessarily uncomfortable at all. To turn it off, you simply toggle the on and off button to turn the unit off again. On. And off again. All right, so let's go ahead and demonstrate this toothbrush in action and uh, give you additional details as far as how it will brush. Uh, see how well the unit goes into those intervals of 30 seconds to let you know to brush in different sections and then the overall conclusion.
So you can clearly see right now the unit is charging. The green light will continue to blink until it's fully charged, turning green and then turning off. Okay guys, so there you have it. So after a couple of days of using this electrical toothbrush, I can conclude that this works great. It has enough power, it cleans your teeth very well, and you can actually feel um, the difference between a regular toothbrush and utilizing one of these brushes to, to brush your teeth. Um, I've used it a couple of times as well, obviously utilizing a different, you know, toothbrush head. Um, and I can tell the difference between a regular toothbrush and utilizing this. As mentioned, uh, it is still very effective. The power of the unit is, is great. It's not overwhelming. And you can actually tell the intervals intervals of the 30 second stuttering that allows you to change from one side to the other. Now, um, some of the drawbacks is obviously that it does have a sensor pressure that tells you whether you're brushing your teeth very hard. So the way to tell is if you're putting a lot of pressure in your teeth, it is supposed to um, stop spinning as fast as it normally would and the brush itself will vibrate a little bit different. Now, I haven't experienced that just because I haven't brushed my teeth and put a lot of pressure on it. I Normally, you just you know put the brush within your teeth and let the brush do its work. Another drawback is obviously these uh, seem to wear out pretty easy just because you know, you're constantly brushing your teeth and it's, and it's brushing your teeth very well. Now from the original one to the imitation, you can kind of tell some of the, uh, you know, wear right away within a couple of days. It's supposed to last within three months. So we'll see if it actually does, but so far it's actually doing the work of, of brushing your teeth very nice. So in conclusion, uh, it is highly recommendable. Uh, to get one of these if you really want to um, get the feel of going to the dentist every day and for your teeth to be really well cleaned. Uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Thank you and I appreciate you. Take care.